This is the book, Proverbs chapter 6. I'm going to read verse 23. For the commandment is a lamp, and the law is light, and reproofs of instruction are the way of life. To keep thee from the evil woman, from the flattery of her tongue of a strange woman. Lust not after her beauty in thine heart, neither let her take thee with her eyelids. Rock thy hawa, rock thy hawa shy, rock thy hawa, rock thy hawa shy, rock thy hawa, rock thy hawa shy. Call halayim la, a halayim awa, yahawa, bahashim, yahawa shy, bahashim, rakahakwadash. Double honors to the elder apostles of Great Millstone that rule well and have taught me this truth. Peace and salutations to the hopeful elect that are scattered abroad within these last days. To you I say, Shalom. And I want to bring out this lesson. First and foremost, I must say this. I don't know this woman. You know, not at all. I just pulled up an image of a woman and I found one. You know, so <clears throat> anyway... I went to the store today, Aki, you know, after I came home from the plantation, stopped there and got some gas and uh, got some wine. So as I stopped there and I walked in the store, you know, I could hear a woman. You know, it's the first thing I could hear was a woman's mouth. You know, you know how these women today, they're, you know, these women are real loud. You know, she kind of looked like this, you know, real, real loud, man, on the phone. You know, and <clears throat> when I looked at the, we call it the, uh, the cashier, man, you know, he had this look. And I was like, yeah. He was like, why she got to talk so loud? I said, I know. So as, as I listened to the conversation more, not trying to eavesdrop, uh, I turned around and looked at her. And she had these shorts on, you know, like uh, kind of like how this lady got this shirt on, you know, like I don't know what kind of texture is that. But, you know, it kind of, uh, you know, some clothes got the texture that say, shh, 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 you know, and, and that's kind of what she had on, you know, as far as her shorts. She had on shorts. So she was on the phone and she was like, oh, my God, like, I'm, I'm leaking and, and, and it's showing through my shorts. And, oh, my God, it's so hot. I was like, ew, man. You know, like, like now, I don't have any children now. What if I would have brought, if I had children, what if I would have brought my children in the store, man? You know, and that was a very nasty thing to hear, man. You know, like, oh, my God, it's leaking, it's leaking all through my shorts, and I'm so wet. I'm like, oh, God, man, like, these women today, man, are finished, Akim. They are finished, man. You know, they are finished. You know, if you got a, a woman, you know, hey, man, make sure she don't go out the house looking like a, 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 a I'll just say, shame-faced woman, man. You know, or, or she's like not a shame-faced woman, but just a, a, a shameless woman, she's like you know, and that woman, man, she had no shame, man. I got in the car, man, and I yelled, man, like, oh, my God, I'm ready to get the hell out of here. You know, and this is what these women have turned in. She made my whole day upside down, man. You know, now, I'm, you know, she ain't really make my day upside down, but that was the nastiest thing that I heard, man. You know, you women have become very low and, 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 and Apostle Gabar was right, man. You black women are the least, most dateable women out here, man. You know, nobody want nothing to do with you women, man. She was talking about her her, her dugout, man, and, and, and how hot it was and how it was leaking through her shorts, man. Very, very, very nasty, man. And I just want to bring that out, man, because... That's pretty much what this lesson is going to be about, man. You women are finished, man. And I cannot wait until the Lord take the pride away from you women, man. You know? I'm going to read this. This is the book of Isaiah, chapter 31, verse, uh, sorry, chapter 32, 
Verse 9. Rise up, ye women that are at ease. Hear my voice, ye careless daughters. Give ear unto my speech. These women, they don't want to hear what we got to say, man. You know, they're, they're not rising up. You know, they're rising down with the ass up, man. You know, these women today are finished, man. You know, these women are at ease. And I can't wait to to, to uh to this draft go on for you so-called black slots, you and Native American women, man. You know, so you can go over there and and, and uh do the Harlem shake and twerk while you get hit with them 50 cow uh, 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 rounds, man. You women are finished, man. You know, they don't want to hear what we got to say. They'd rather still be bugged out, man. And that's why I don't deal with these women out here, man, because they finished. That was a very nasty thing for me to hear, man. It's wet, wet, and it's leak, and it's hot. I'm like, ew, man. Like, come on, man. You know, and she and she was built up like a, 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 a I'll just say, a demon, man. You know, these women today, man, they, they have no, no kind of respect for themselves. Not at all, man. These women will love to ride the cock carousel, man. And this is a woman, when I looked at her, you could tell that she ride the cock carousel. Then when I went out to the car and looked, it was only one car in the parking lot. And I knew it was her car. Hey, man, it was beat down, man. And she had track and weave and all that in her hair and her, and her car was finished, man. You know, so you women today are, are are finished, man. My goodness, man. I'm going to read this, Akim. This is the book. I don't have too much to say, man. This is the book of uh, Sirach, chapter 25, and I'm going to read verse 16. I would rather dwell with a lion and, and a dragon than to keep house with a wicked woman. That's right, man. Somebody like that, I feel bad for the guy that's dealing with that kind of woman, man. She was just all in the store on the phone talking like that, man. Verse 17, the wickedness of a woman changeth her face and darkeneth her countenance like sackcloth. And that woman, you can tell that she had demons on her, man. Talking like that, she, she ain't care who was in the store listening to her, man. And I can't wait till the Lord start kicking these women out of their houses and 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 and, and all of that, man. You know, the Lord's uh, 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 roughly paraphrasing. Uh, the Lord have made a new thing in the earth. You know how these women they will com uh, 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 um, compass a man. You know, I can't wait till the Lord bring these women back to their knees, man. A lot of them on their knees now, but I mean, like you know, uh, uh, uh Bring them back to a humble state, man. These women, man, hey, hey, man, a lot of them are vexing to even look at, man. I'm going to read this. This is the book of Sirach, chapter 25. And I'm going to read, uh, I'm going to read verse, verse 11. Watch over an impudent eye and marvel not if she trespass against thee. She will open her mouth as a thirsty traveler when he hath found a fountain and drink of every water near her. By every head she will sit down and open her quiver against every arrow. And that woman looked like she was, you know, that kind of woman, man. You know, she she, she didn't care if anyone was was listening to her conversation, man. It's hot, it's wet, my, my dugout leaking all, I'm like, oh my goodness. This is the book of uh, Sirach chapter 26, I'm going to read verse, uh, verse 25. A shameless woman shall be counted as a dog, but she that hath shame face will fear the Lord. These women today, they're not shame-faced, man. There's only a few of them, man. A few. You know, and, I, you know, these women that are trying to do their best, you know, to get right, you know, 
you know, this not for for them kind of women. But I'm talking about these women that you just see out here just doing whatever they want to do, man. Goodness, man, these women are finished, man. These women are a bunch of bug outs, man, for the most part, man. And the shameless woman will be counted worthy as a dog, man. And the way she was talking, Akim, she sounded like she was a dog, man. And again, I feel I, I feel bad for the dude that's dealing with that woman, man. Oh my goodness, man. She had no kind of no nothing about her, man. She was just saying, just just didn't care who was listening, just you know, and, and again she looked like this. Women today are finished. You so called black lots, you and Native American women, man, get on my damn nerve. I'm telling you, man, y'all get on my nerves, man. I see it everywhere I go. You know, I just want to bring out this quick, you know, uh, I guess you can call it a testimony in the spirit, man. You know, I, man, I can't wait to see women uh, 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 feel the heat, man. You know, and I'm not going to shed not one tear, man. Not at all. I can't wait till the animals start and get to these women and all of that, man. You got a lot of bug out dudes out here that's they got their eye on these women that are bugged out, man. And they're going to ravage them, period. And with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and end this video right here, Israel. Shalom. You know, I just want to bring this out real quick, man. Call Halayim La, Ahalayanawa, Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai. Shalom.